In the previous questions, we looked at questions 1 to 20, and for this lesson, we'll be looking at questions 21 to 40, because um, the entrance exam mathematics has 40 questions. Without wasting time, let's look at question 21. This question says, the total weight of three articles is 138.52 kg. So, there are three articles here. We are doing sum of three is equal to 138.52 kilogram. Now, they give us the weight of two of them. So, let's find out the sum of two of them, which will be 555.20 plus 43. Point four five. You can take this down, okay? So if we sum this up, we have five. Four plus two is six. Five plus three is eight, and five plus four is nine. So sum of two is ninety-eight point six five. What are we looking for? Find the weight of the third article. Here yeah, we are looking for just sum of one. Remember, there are three articles. We have the sum of three. We have the sum of the two. To get the sum of one. Or the value of the third article, we just subtract the sum of two from the sum of three. Sum of three is one three eight point five two minus ninety eight point six five. All right, so let's have this. Two minus five is not possible. Borrow one from five. Five reduces to four. Put the one here. Twelve. Twelve minus five seven. Borrow 1 from 8, 8 reduces to 7. Put the 1 in 4, it became 14. 14 minus 6 is 8. Now, borrow 1 from 3, 3 reduces to 2. Put the 1 here, is 17. 17 minus 8 is 9. This one, borrow it, this become nothing. Put it here, 12 minus 9 is 3. So the right answer is 39.87 kilogram. Question 22, we have decimals. 0 0.2 okay we are meant to add them up so 0 0.2 plus 0 0.8 plus 4.0 then 2.4 let's add this together 8 plus 2 is 10 10 plus 4 is 14 you put the 4 and move the 1 4 plus 2 is 6 plus the 1 7 so our answer is 7.4 grams which is option e so let's scroll down to question 23. This question says, How many weeks are there in five months? One month, for one month, we have four weeks. Four weeks make one month. So for five months, you just multiply by what? Five. It will give us 20 weeks. So the correct option for this is B. Which of the following shapes is plain, circle, cube, cylinder, pyramid, sphere? The only plain shape here is A, a circle. A cube, a cylinder, pyramid, sphere, they are all three-dimensional shapes that have depth, so they are not plain shapes. Alright, question 25 says, what is the name of the shape below? A, kite. B, prism. C pyramid, D rectangle, E triangle. It is not a triangle, nor a rectangle. It is not a kite, neither is it a pyramid. So the right answer is a prism. Now the big question is, why did I say this shape is a prism? A prism is a shape or a 3D shape that the top and the bottom are the same. You can see for this shape, the top is a triangle and the bottom is a triangle as well. That is why prism is the correct answer. Question 26 says, A car. A car is moving at an average speed of 60 kilometers per hour. Now, the speed of the car has been given as 60 kilometers per hour. Calculate the distance covered in what time? 
in three hours. The formula for calculating distance, distance D is equal to speed times time. I just abbreviated D stands for distance, S for speed, and T for time. So this is the formula. To get the distance, we simply uh, multiply the speed, which is 60 kilometers per hour, by the time, which is 3, and our answer will be 180 kilometers. Among the options we have, D is the correct answer. Question 27 says, determine the radius of a circle whose diameter is 21 centimeters. In a circle, a diameter is a straight line that divides a circle into two equal parts and a radius is half of a diameter. So if the diameter is 21 centimeters, radius is simply half of it. So you divide by, by two, all right? So this is 10.5 centimeters. A is the correct answer. Now question 28. This question says, what is the total cost of 100,000 shares at 50 Kobo each and 70,000 shares at 70 Kobo each? So for the first one, the total cost of 100,000 shares at 50 Kobo each, it will be 50 Kobo times 100,000. Okay, so let's get the total worth of the 100,000 shares. So it will give us 50, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, Kobo. That's a what? To change this to Naira, you cancel out two zeros. So the answer will be 50,000 Naira. So that will be the worth of 100,000 shares at 50 Kobo each. And then 70,000 shares at 70 Kobo each will be 70 Kobo times 70,000. Okay, so 7 times 7 is 49. Bring out the zeros. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. These um, will give us about... Okay, look at what we have. Let's change it to Naira. Cancel out two zeros. So we have 49,000 Naira. Okay, 49,000 Naira. So let's get the total. The total will be 50,000 for the first 100,000 shares and then 49,000 for the second for the 70,000 shares let's sum this is 0, 0, 0, 0, 000 99 so nera so our answer will simply be 99,000 nera which is option c Let's move up to question 29. This question says, the total weight of a goods and a sheep is 21 kilograms, 70, 20 grams. That's the weight of both of them. So for 29, let's have it here. The total T is 21 kg, 720 grams. If the weight of the sheep is 11 kg 155 grams, find the weight of the goat. So, we have, let's do it this way, kilograms, grams. The total weight is 21 kilogram, 720, gr 720 grams, minus the weight of the sheep, which is 11 kilogram, 155 grams. What we get to be the weight of the goat. So borrow 1 from 2, this is 1, put it here, 10 minus 5 is 5. Borrow 1 from 7 reduces to 6, put it here, 11 minus 5 is 6, 6 minus 1 is 5, 1 minus 1 is 0, 2 minus 1 is 1. So the answer will be D, which is 10 kilogram, 565 grams. Question 30 says, change... 6,000 meters to kilometers. To solve this, I want you to know that 1,000 meters is equal to 1 kilometers. So to change 6,000 meters to kilometers, you simply divide 6,000 
by 1000 since 1000 is a unit of their conversion these three zeros cancels these three zeros and the correct answer will be a i'm going to clean the board to create space all right let's look at um question 31 Okay, now question 31 says, calculate the area of the shaded portion in the diagram below. I'm going to give you a formula. To get a shaded part, the formula you use is um, shaded is equal to whole area of everything minus the unshaded. So S stands for shaded, W for whole, the whole shape, and U for the unshaded shape. The, so to get the shaded, the shape is a rectangle. This side is 7 centimeters, this side is 10 centimeters. So the whole will be length times breadth. So whole is equal to the length 10 centimeters by 7 centimeters, which will give me 70 centimeters square. That is the area of the whole. Replace W here with 70 minus the unshaded. This inner one is um, U, will also be length times breadth. So to get the unshaded, the length is 6 centimeters, that's this one. And then the breadth is 2 centimeters, which is this. So the unshaded will be 6 times 2, 12 centimeters squared. We have the unshaded, which is 12. So to get the shaded, shaded will be 70 minus 12. Borrow 1 from 7 reduces to 6, 10. 10 minus 2, 8. 6 minus 1, 5. So the answer is 58 centimeter square, and the correct option is C. Question 32 says If 1 liter of oil, 1 liter weighs 2.0 kilogram, find the weight of 5 liters in kilogram. You multiply by 5, that's 10 kilogram and the right answer is b question 33 says solve for x 3x plus 5 is equal to minus 7 collect like terms move plus 5 to the right hand side as plus 5 crosses this equal to sign 3x will be at the left hand side we have minus 7 as plus crosses the equal to sign, it will change to minus 5. So 3x is equal to. If the signs are the same, you do addition and put the sign you have. Since you have minus minus, my answer must be minus. If you have plus plus, your answer must be plus. So 7 plus 5 is 12. We have this now. Now divide both sides by 3. 3 cancels 3. 3 will go into 12 4 times. My answer is minus 4, which is. D. Question 34 says, find the LCM of 48 okay, and 60. So to solve for LCM, we have to draw a vertical line and then start from the smallest number that can go. Let's work with 2. 2 here, 24 into 60 is 30. 2 into 24 is 12, into 30 is 15. 2 into 12 is 6, into 15 cannot go. 2 into 6 is 3, into 15 cannot go. 2 is done with his work, so we use um, 3 can go. Let me write the 3 here. Okay, let me bring down this 3 and 15 downward. Okay, 3 into 3 is 1, into 15 is 5, then 5 here, 1, 1. To get the LCM, we have to multiply the the um, the divisors, which is what we have here. Okay? So, LCM is equal to, how many twos do we have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. Now, times 3 times 5. 
Okay, so 2 times 2 is 4. 4 times 2 is 8. 8 times 2 is 16. 3 times 5 is 15. So 16 times 15 will give us our answer. 5 times 6 is 30. 0. You put 3 here. 5 times 4 and 5 plus 3 is 8. 1 times 6 is 6 and 1 times 1 is 1. Sum this up. 0. 8 plus 6 is 14. 4 put 1 here. 1 plus 1 is 2. The LCM is 240, which is B. All right, I'm sure that is clear. Let's take a look at question 35. Question 35 says, find the value of x. 5x out of 8 is equal to 10. All whole numbers have a denominator of 1. To get the value of x, you cross multiply. 5x times 1 is 5x. And 8 times 10 is 80. Now divide both sides by 5 to get the value of x. 5 cancels 5. x is equal to 80 divided by 5. 8 divided by 5 is 1 remainder 3. Put the 3 on top of 0. That will give you 30. 30 divided by 5 is 6. So 80 divided by 5 is 16. And the correct option is C. All right, um, question 36. What fraction of the diagram is shaded? Of course, we have the diagram has been divided into four parts. The denominator must be four. For a fraction, the denominator tells you how many parts that fraction has been divided into. And one out of the four parts has been shaded. So the correct answer is A. So question 37, the board. this question says, Mr. Essay wants to send $500 to his brother in America. How much will he send if a dollar is equivalent to 718 error? So $1 is equal to 718 error. How much will $500 be? You simply multiply with 500 to get your answer. Multiply with this zero, 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 zero. Multiply with this zero, 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 zero. Multiply with the five. Five times zero is zero. Five times eight, 40, zero. Put four here. Five times seven, 35 plus four, 39. Now let's sum this up. Bring down this zero. Bring down this zero, bring down this zero, bring down this zero, bring down the nine and the three. So our answer will be three hundred and ninety thousand error. Among the options we have, C is the correct answer. Question thirty eight says. All right, now this question says. Salako is 16 years old. How old was he 11 years ago? That's 16 minus 11, which is 5. The right answer is D. Question 39. Find the average of 50, 59, and 71. To find average, just sum up the items and divide by how many they are by the number of items. So sum this item up. Since there are 3, you have to divide by 3. 50 plus 59 plus 71. 9 plus 1 is 10, 0 put 1 here. 5 plus 5 is 10 plus 7, 17 plus 1, 18. So we have 180. 180, which is the sum of items, divided by 3. The number of items we give us 60, and the correct answer is C. The last question is question 40. Find the mode of the following scores. Mode simply means um, the number that appeared most or the one with the highest frequency. And the right answer is D5. Five appeared twice and other digits appeared just once. So, thank you. Um, I've been able to solve all the questions in this year's um, National Common Entrance. This will really be very helpful as you prepare for subsequent common entrance examination.